What's up everyone, Jeremy here from MTG Headquarters and I've got the brand new Fate Reforged intro deck, Unflinching Assault. This is the uh, Orzov black-white combination. <clears throat> I assume they kept the uh, intro decks two color to keep them simple, but any all, Unflinching Assault. Marshal your armies onto the battlefield, then use the bolster mechanic to enhance your creatures and hold your ground. Pressure your opponent with continuous offense and demonstrate your supremacy in the art of war. Inside this box, you'll get a ready-to-play 60-card deck featuring a foil premium Dragon Scale General, which is legit, and two new Fate Reforged packs, a deck strategy insert, and a rules reference card. Yeah, Dragon Scale General is a bomb, no doubt. No doubt a bomb. First pickable. Windmill slam and draft. All that sort of thing. So if you want to learn how to play the deck, if you're new to the game, they have this the, kind of the how to play guide here. Uh, so check that out. Let's take a look at the included cards. Here's your foil dragon scale general. At the beginning of your end step, bolster X, where X is the number of tapped creatures. Uh, <clears throat> in a black-white tokens deck, that seems really, really good. Um, I don't know if... I mean, I could imagine if some sort of black-white tokens was a thing in standard that it could see some fringe play if it's not a thing then obviously it won't it's only good in i don't know if just guy tokens would play it i don't think so but uh this is a super powerful mechanic probably not standard playable cruel sadist is our rare avenge skirmisher that's a new one mardu hate blades so we're just full-on black white aggressive black white warriors chief of the edge chief of the scale you can improve this deck with any more of these. Totally could be four ofs in this deck. Hooded Assassin's very good. Merciless Executioner is very good in an aggressive deck. So is Obs on Sky Captain. You've got a lot of Warriors, a lot of Evasion. You've got some fixing here. Pretty good. Pretty good. I think if you're an Obs on type person, this is not a bad way to learn the game. You've got Debilitating Air Injury. Two of them. <coughs> Premium Limited uh, removal there. Honor's Reward, uh, pay, pay three to bolster two, I guess, basically, and the gain for life is not that relevant. Sandblast is good. Di Dipl Diplomacy of Wastes, Harsh Sustenance, Decent Removal Spell, two of those. Rush of Battle, you could play more of those if you wanted. Two Raider Spoils, very good. Uh, take Up Arms to uh, make some 1-1 one -one White Warrior creatures, and a Throttle. <laughs> You could definitely have a lot of fun with this, swap it around, see if you wanted to run it in a way that produced a lot more creatures. You could run more take-up arms. You could run all sorts of fun stuff from the new set as you open it to improve that deck. So that one might be pretty fun. Let's see what we get in the booster packs. I'll also provide a link in the description below where you can go buy it, or you can pick it up at your local game store once the set drops um, in just a few days. I already see some playables for this deck. Dallas and Gloom's pretty good removal. <clears throat> and limited, anyway. Pretty good removal all, uh, all over, I think. Turn to Earth is a nice sideboard card for draft. Obzon Beastmaster, very good. Grave Strength. Mind Scour Dragon, Uncommon Blue Dragon. And our rare is a Stance. Sandseat Mastodon. This one could go right in the deck. 7 mana, 5-5 five, five with reach. When it enters the battlefield, bolster 5. That card is legit in draft. And all sorts of other fun casual formats. Limited formats. It's pretty bananas. Putting out 10 power. It's pretty good. Uh, Mardu, it's also part of the infinite combo, I believe. <clears throat> Mardu Shadow Sphere. Quarry High Priest, Sudden Reclamation, and we have a Citadel Siege. Any and all of the sieges are very, very good. This one happens to pay two. Uh, this could go right in the deck, too. So two on-color rares for this deck. That's great. Uh, as it enters the battlefield, choose cons or dragons. Cons, at the beginning of your turn, put two 1-1 one -one counters on target creature you control. Bananas. Dragons, at the beginning of combat of each opponent's turn, tap target creature that player controls. Pretty bananas. Uh, 
I don't know. I mean, it seems like the Converse is just much better, but very, very good. Bloodfell Kiss. Ooh, very cool warrior token there. Very cool, I think. So that is the Unflinching Assault intro deck. Link in the, is in the description below if you like it. If you're new to the channel, please take a moment to crush that subscribe button so you can see each and every new product that Fate Reforged brings. We'll talk to you again real soon. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already, check out some of our most popular playlists from MTG vlogs, sick gameplay videos, new product breaks, and some insane vintage openings. I upload three to four new Magic the Gathering videos every week. So if you haven't already, please take a moment to crush that subscribe button to join one of the fastest growing Magic the Gathering channels on YouTube. Talk to you later.